Hmm? Oh, yeah. Uh, that's the Altaran symbol for wind. It looks like a, a pitchfork, almost, if you ask me. Hmm? Uh, oh, yeah, and uh, that's our symbols for water and fire. <laughs> wow. This book really does have a lot of information about the elements and magic stuff. I mean, I can help you with the reading, of course, but... I'm not all too familiar with the fancy arcane stuff. Yeah, arcane. That book there you have is full of it. I can almost feel it. I bet if a mage or scholar took a look at that thing, they'd be able to tell you how to use it. Me? I just stick with the physical stuff. There isn't much a little backbone can't fix, in my opinion. Heck, I held the whole farm together by myself before you showed up. But then again, I am half bull. I'm kind of born for stuff like that. Literally. Uh, how about you, darling? Uh, anything you're good at back where you came from? Hmm, really? That's kind of a shocker. <laughs> well, if there's another thing you're good at, it's making a certain bull man feel uh, a lot more happy in life. <laughs> yeah, ever since you showed up, his life has been a hell of a lot more interesting. In a good way, that is. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I guess traveling long distances by foot is always a good time to learn stuff. I wonder how much we'll be able to learn about that book before we reach the sanctuary. And, well, there's still the problem of you being a human. They most likely won't let you in, or they may even detain you just for that. The leader there wants to make sure the sanctuary is a safe place for all the half-bloods, which to him means that Humans can't learn of its existence. That's why it's a sanctuary. Most humans on Altera aren't like you. They see us as tools and property. I can't blame too many of them too much. It's just how they were raised to believe. So, when they see you, they aren't going to feel... Good about letting you get too close. Some people there have had it bad before. Some may be even worse than me. So that's why they want to keep it a sanctuary. So those people can live out the rest of their lives in peace. And not have to worry about... Yeah. Uh, hey. Maybe there's some sort of... A magic to disguise you in that book somewhere. I mean, it's filled with arcane stuff, so I wouldn't be surprised if it had a way to make you look like a half-blood. Or anything else, at least. And then we can both get into the sanctuary and relax for a bit until we figure out where to go from there. But until then, we just have to follow this path and... Make sure we aren't being followed. This seems simple enough. <sighs> I had to open my damn mouth. I thought we would still have a day or two before the weather rolled in, but... <sighs> I feel like the divines above have it out for me too. Can I ever just catch a break? Uh, come on. We need to hurry into that passage area. We may be able to get shelter from the approaching storm there. Uh, yeah, l let's go.